What is up guys, welcome back to yet another tutorial. Today I'm gonna to be teaching you East Side of Sorrow by Zach Bryan. So the way I'm gonna do this tutorial is I will break down the chorus and the verses, both the strumming patterns and the chords that you're gonna need. And after that, after all the whole explaining thing, I'll play it through at one time, just so you can get kind of an idea of what it's gonna sound like. Wait, that rhymed, okay. Anyway, so if you wanna play this song, you're gonna take your capo and you're gonna place it on the third fret of your guitar. The chords that you're gonna need for this are super easy, so as long as you can really do the beginner chords, you are gonna be fine. There's no bar chords, no nothing. And basically, the chords you're gonna need for this is gonna be a G, uh, C at nine. You can also play a normal C, but it's gonna make more sense if you play the C at nine, like that. Uh, a E minor, and a D. Now something I might do is I might play the E minor seven like this, where I basically keep my pinky and my ring finger um, on the uh, third fret of the first and second string, um, which is going to sound like this instead of the normal, uh, which kind of has a happier tone. Uh, you know, it, it, yeah, it's the Wonderwall chord basically if you were wondering, but just so you don't get confused. So starting off with the verse, um, that's going to be the harder part of the song. Um, it's not really that difficult, but it is going to be, a, the strumming pattern is going to be a bit more tricky if you're just starting out, but you'll be fine. You're going to need the chords uh, with the chord progression G. Then a C at nine. Uh, you're gonna go back to G. Then a D. And then you're gonna start the strumming pattern all over again. And for strumming pattern, it's basically down, down, up, down, up. If uh, for the first G, so you're gonna play down, down, up, down, up. Uh, and then you can do a little transition strum, such as up, down, up. But you're just gonna do it like you're not gonna emphasize it as much as the other strums. It's gonna be like a little like that. Uh, you're gonna go to the C, you're gonna play down, down, up, and then you're gonna go back to the G and then play down, down, up, down, up again. And then again, a little transition strum such as down, up, then a uh, down, down, up at the D, and then you're gonna uh, go back to the G and play the down, down, up, down, up all over again from the start. Now if this confused you, let me play it through it for a second and then I'll also put the chords up on screen always with the strumming pattern you're going to need under it. So in case you have any troubles, just try reading off of that. And um, yeah, I think you'll be fine. Just practice a little bit and trust me, you'll get it just fine. So if you put it all together, it's going to sound something like this. Let me know in the comments if you have any specific questions. Maybe I can help you, but I feel like this is as broken down as possible as it gets. So, but if you have any questions, don't hesitate, just drop them in the comments. All right, moving on to the chorus. This is gonna be the easier part of the song. You're gonna need the chord C, G, D, and E minor. Which is also gonna be the chord progression for that song. Um, for strumming pattern, this one's gonna be easy. You just play down, down, up, down, up once every chord, and you just play it through the whole chorus. So if you put that all together, it should sound something like this. And yeah, this will literally be everything you need to know in order to play East Side of Sorrow by Zach Bryan. And now before I play through it, something that he does in the last chorus, he just one strums everything. So if you play the last chorus after the guitar solo, you just one strum it like. You get the idea. Now thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna play through it now so you can kind of get an idea of what it's gonna sound like. If you have any problems, any questions, drop them in the comments. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. We're currently on the road to 1,000 subscribers, so I'd definitely be grateful if you help me out. And uh, yeah, thank you so much. <clears throat> I lost friends in the August heat And I didn't scarred I'd always meet I said, Lord, won't you bring me home? I got women in the West I wanna hold well, I lost you in the 
in a wet room after sleeping there for a week or two. Doctor said he did all he could. You were the last thing that I had that was good. So I walked miles on a Tulsa street, lost out of beaming in from the east. 6 a.m. up again, asking God where the hell he Said the sun's gonna rise tomorrow Somewhere on the east side of sorrow Better pack your bags where stick out your chest And then hit the road The sun's gonna rise tomorrow Somewhere on the east side of sorrow Better give it a reason to follow Let it be, then let it go Well, my mine in the city last fall Was it his blood or the conscience or the alcohol? And he be doing well, did he wind up sick Like every other brave boy from these run-down sticks? You ever get tired singing songs Like all your pants, just another freaking sing-along? You ever get the time to come on home? I heard the term I back together in the rhyme song Said the sun's gonna rise tomorrow Somewhere on the east side of sorrow Better pack your bags west Stick out your chest and then hit the road The sun's gonna rise tomorrow Somewhere on the east side of sorrow Let it be, let it be, let it be.